before he cropped up. What up, though? Yo, what's going on, everybody? I hope you guys are having an amazing day. Can you tell that I'm cold? It's like 20 degrees where I'm at right now. It's cold. I'm as cold as I. Right when this video releases, I'm probably in Florida right now. All right, on the beach, seagulls, pina colada. And while I thought this would be a great time to go through all the stuff that I've bought throughout the year. I'm not gonna lie, I think I spent a lot on like shoes, clothing, accessories, and yeah. Also, don't forget to hit that like button right now because, because uh, uh-huh, hit that like button. And we do have a giveaway coming up in this video, so make sure you guys stay tuned for that. But y'all, let's get into this. <laughs> Boom, I'm back. I told you I'm coming back with the heat <laughs> and the hiccup, <laughs> but I'm back. Back in the boo ha. Right here, this is a miracle lemonade rug. Now, I ended up ordering this boy a while ago, but yo, check out how dope this is. Check this rug out, though. This is from Cole Bennett. He makes some of the coolest music videos for rappers, but I shouldn't even have to explain it. If you guys know, you know. Cole Bennett seems like such a genuine person, like just like a dope dude to be around, and his edits are on point. Extremely cool rug though. I love what he's doing with Lyrical Lemonade. Lyrical Lemonade is just gonna, it's gonna transform into something way bigger than it is right now. I mean, it's already huge, but it's said. just gonna keep growing and getting bigger. <laughs> Now this piece right here is from Anti-Supremacy. Now my dad ended up copping this boy right here. This is fire. First up, this box is just dope, alright? It's like a, like a granite or like marble or like whatever the heck that kind of material is. And then once we open this boy up... Okay. It's this extremely dope sculpture. I just, I love every little thing about it. Next up, we got these boys right here. You guys already saw these, but like, I got them for my birthday, and like, I wanna show you again. So these right here are the Converse Chuck Taylor All-Stars. Now, as you guys can already see, the cool thing about these is the entire shoe is Velcro. Now, what's cool about this, they also give you different colors and different patches. So like, check this out, boom. Whole different shoe. Extremely dope shoe though. This was done by the guy named Joshua Vides. He does all the like cartooning stuff. Next up. Now this right here is the Supreme Mary JT. It's super cool. I'm not gonna end up taking it out of the plastic. I'll just flash a picture up on the screen. Whenever I see somebody's face on a Supreme T, I like straight go for it. All right, I don't care who it is. I'm going for it. You think I know who Mary J Bliggy is? No. All I'm trying to say, if it was Mary J Jimmy Heimer Schmidt, I still would have copped. But next up, you guys have probably saw already, but I went to the store and I cashed out on some Reese's Puffs. These guys right here are the Travis Scott Reese's Puffs edition. Now, what's really cool about these boxes is I realized that you can live off of Reese's Puffs for an entire week and still be alive. But next up, we got this boy right here. Now these, boom. Now you might be thinking, Oh, how you showed us these in the last video? No, I did not. Don't tell me what you're talking about. I got two. These guys right here are the Yeezy Adidas Power Face. I pretty much already showed you guys this last video, but here they are again. Nice little suede. But yep, super clean shoe. Can't wait to rock them. Now all of these right here. This was made by an artist named Denial. This was like a Supreme Pill. It's like a cool little skate deck that's inspired. Now these things are actually going for a lot of cash. I actually saw these things on eBay going from anywhere to 350 to 800. That's why your boy got three of them. It's a pretty cool inspired piece though. It's like, can you guys get it? Like it's a pill. Next up, we got these right here. Now, am I a little jealous? Yeah, all right, I'll, I'll admit it, I'm a little bit jealous. Not even a little bit, I'm a lot of bit jealous. All right, sprinkle some salt on my head and call me uh, jellyfish because my dad ended up copying these right here and these are some converse the name of them is called the floating stripe first up i just want to say the leather on the shoe is killer the sole on the shoe is killer just everything about the shoe is amazing everybody give a second to clap for the dad you saw dad 
JK, I love you. I just really like these shoes. We got these right here, and hopefully you guys can tell what these are by the pink box. These are some Nike SBs. Now right here, my dad ended up picking up these. I feel like this is just his video today, all right? He's picked up so many stuff that I showed. Like, did I even show anything I picked up this video? Oh my gosh. Anyways, he wanted these shoes so bad for the longest time and finally got them. That's probably one of the best feelings once you finally get a shoe that you've been wanting for so long. But these right here are the Diamond Dunk Low SBs. You got that beautiful Tiffany blue color going on the shoe. And then, and like I already showed you guys, these Nike swooshes are Velcro. Such a clean shoe. I'm pretty sure he actually got these things for a really, really good price too. He did end up buying them used, which was a good thing, but they like, they barely look used. So it was like, yeah. Definitely a cool shoe. I hate to break it to you, Dad. I think the white ones are 10 times fire. I mean, they're just clean. Tiffany blue with white? <laughs> I mean, that's just, that's right. I rhyme that. See, if it rhymes, that means it's true. My stomach really hurts. I think I gotta, uh-oh. Now this right here is the Supreme Butterfly Paddle. It's not a paddle for smacking that abs. Abs. YouTube, don't demonetize me. I said abs, all right. I'm gonna get you if you do. All right, I'm gonna get your abs. <laughs> I'm gonna get your abs. I'm gonna find that abs, boy. All right, this just sounds wrong. Anyways, this right here is the Supreme Table Tennis Paddle for table tennis. I'm not gonna end up opening the box, so I'll flash up some pictures of it. It did seem super deluxe though, so like if I played table tennis, pfft, I'd be whipping it. I'm gonna be showing you guys all the stuff that I picked up over the last like month and a half. To be honest, I feel like I spent way too much cash this month. All right, my wallet is hungry. Feed me. So we got this boy right here. Now this, I ended up copying a Supreme Voodoo doll and then right here, some Supreme socks. This Voodoo doll is a little scary. There's a lot of bad words on it. So I'm gonna hold it far away of the camera so I don't get demonetized. But I ended up giving one of these away a little bit ago. And also we got some Supreme Socks. This is like the red color way out of the socks. I'm like, yo, Christmas time is right around the corner. I gotta give me some red Supreme socks. And I'm turning into Santa with these. So this right here is the Supreme Smoke Tea. Oh, and speaking of smoke, oh my gosh. I went to a casino the other day and it's like, it just smelled like smoke so bad. And it's like, if you go to eat there, it's like everything's smoked. Like, let's say you get some chicken. That's smoked chicken. Oh, what would you like to drink with that? Lemonade, oh, smoked lemonade. Smoked fries, smoked strawberries. And to top it all off, once you're done, you eat your smoked gum. But yeah, it's the first time in the casino. It was actually pretty fun, I'm not gonna lie. And I've, where was I going with this? The smoked shirt. <laughs> These boys right here is some Adidas. <laughs> Adidas? Adidas nuts. What? Yo, these right here are super dope. Size 8. These right here are the Adidas Beastie Boys collab. Did end up getting these off of Stock X. These things go for around like $300 or something like that. This right here is the Supreme Banner Skate Deck. I really like this thing. It's pretty cool. Just the way like the BOGO's placed and everything. I always used to put a Supreme sticker right in the middle of my board. And that definitely reminds me of when I used to do that. Pretty cool board though. It is kind of massive. This right here is the Supreme smoke skate deck this thing is just clean this is definitely another hanger I'm probably gonna have to take this wrap off because it's just so glary oh hi there mr. ring light how you doing oh and yo I forgot to show you guys this is so dope you guys are gonna be so excited to see this I bet you any money you guys did not expect that one or this one That was you. Things. These are a pair of Balenciaga Triple S's. These shoes are, I love these shoes. Okay, I've always wanted a pair of Balenciaga Triple S's. They just look so cool. Like, I don't know why, but I love them. They weigh like four pounds, like legit four pounds. I put these things on the scale, four pounds. They wait, they, these shoes wait four pounds. So like you guys know those like super happy girls who go on a jog in the morning, who wear those like little like ankle things and they skip around with them on. You don't even need those anymore. Just cop yourself a pair of Balenciaga. Wow, you made it this far into the video. You know what that means, right? No. 
That's right! Giveaway! Guys, this giveaway is gonna be stupid easy to enter. Today, we are giving away a free pair of custom Louis Vuitton shorts. Check these boys out. These are from the brand Fuzzy Fabrics. And as I said, it is so easy to win these. All you have to do is follow at Fuzzy Fabrics on Instagram and follow your boy at Connor TV on Instagram and tag three people in my most recent post on Instagram. And that's it, boy. Now, guys, there's going to be three different colorways that you guys have to choose from. They got the blue, brown, and black and white ones. And if you win the giveaway, you have a choice to pick out whatever one you want. So do the giveaway. It's pretty easy. Yeah, let's get back to the video. But next up, listen, I don't know what in me made me do this this month, but I just felt like doing it. And it was kind of an impulse buy, but like at the same time... You're kind of happy with it. Yeah, well, I was at the mall, and you know what? Let me just show you guys. I was walking around in the mall, and I ended up seeing this thing right here, and oh my gosh. First off, just look at the packaging, all right? We got a little squishy squishy right here. We pulled this boy out, and look. It's a cute little pillow. I might sleep with this tonight. But guys, check this out. This right here is a brand new Gucci watch I just picked up. This thing is just dope. I've always wanted a Gucci watch. I was going to end up getting this Gucci B watch, but it just... For the price, it was the same price as this one, and they just, you couldn't compare the two, alright? This one was ten times better. But yeah, super happy I got this thing. This is like one of those watches where you wear where you're like, you're going out, alright? You going to a nice restaurant, and you going out. So if you see me wearing this, just know I'm going out. Next up, we got a pair of shoes right here that, uh... I don't know how to feel about them. Check these out. These right here, as you guys can see, is a collab with Breaking Bad. Just check out the box, all right? The box looks pretty flippin' cool. I like how on the back you got all these, like, hazard signs and all this crazy stuff. This is actually a collab with K-Swiss. Oh, that's super cool, too. They got, like, the periodic table on the shoe wrap. Pretty flippin' cool, but yo, <laughs> check these things out. Yeah, this right here is the shoe. The whole yellow is supposed to symbolize, like, the hazmat suit. Icy blue bottoms is supposed to symbolize that, like, uh... And yo, don't quote me on this, but maybe this like little pink thing right here, maybe that's supposed to symbolize like the uh, the face mask that they use. But yeah, I never really messed with K-Swiss that much. I, I think it's a cool looking shoe. I'm I'm kind of on the border of it. Like I'm like, and eh, they're they're kind of cool, and then and eh, yeah. Okay, so guys, so check these out right here. These are the Yeezy. I don't even know what these are called. I'm not gonna lie. I've been off my Yeezy game recently. I, any Yeezy that's been releasing, I just been chilling at home, not really doing anything about it. I'm not gonna say Yeezys are dead, cause like I'll still wear a Yeezy every once in a while. But like something about the V2s, it's just they're just not hitting right. I. Just, what do you guys think? Is there way too many colorways now? I still really like the shoe. It's just. I just haven't been rocking them like that. This boy is dope, all right? Check this out. This right here is an art piece by the artist El Cappy. He's actually based in Detroit, and, like, that's where I'm from, so, like, gotta represent. Super cool artist, though. This right here is, like, a gold yard, Louis Vuitton. A little bit of Supreme action going on. Super cool piece. I absolutely love this thing. Shout out to Dad for copying this for the room. It actually looks really, really good in there. Check these out right here. I did end up showing a little sneak peek of these in the last video. This right here, oh my gosh, I wanted these things so bad. These right here are the Off-White Jordan 5s. I, I tried so hard to get these. I was in there, I was on Nike, and I just, I don't do good on Nike. Yeah, Dad got lucky, he ended up winning the raffle. I think if I were to rock these things though, I'd probably rock them with the white laces. I think that'd be a really, really cool look. Alright, so this is the life hack right here. You get your underwear, and you like, you put your head through the leg, and then once your head's in the leg, you put like the band, like this, and then you like, twist it. Then go like that. Oh my gosh, I don't think, I don't think I'm doing it right. Oh my god, this, this hurts. Wait, alright, so you put your, your other leg through your head like that. Tuck this under there, and like that. And then I think that's it. Now I can go to the grocery store. Not gonna lie, it kinda stinks in there. I can feel the pink eye already starting. Alright, I'm gonna put my pants back on, but uh... 
What up, though? This right here at the Yeezy 700s. Check these wheels out. I ended up, oh man, that Yeezy fart again. I ended up getting these off the site Ludi. Such a clean shoe. I still never put these on. Well, no, I have put them on. I just haven't wore them out yet. The material on these things are insane. They're like, they almost remind me of like an alien shoe. I do really like the bottoms, though. The bottoms are like this cool blue. It's definitely a pretty unique shoe. The material on here is like, I don't know what kind of material this is, but it's, it's cool. Wow. They're called the Yeezy 700 Azales. I don't even know what an Azale is. It kind of sounds like it'd be a part of the family of uh, jackalobes. So like instead of like a bunny with antlers, these things would probably be like a, a squirrel with antlers. Yeah, that's this shoe. I always ask you guys on what I should open up my next box with. And one of you guys suggested to open up this next box with the off-white keep off rug. That's a good one. Alright, Whiskers, bring yourself! That didn't work. You know what, wait a second, does this count? Or am I just like... <sighs> I think it's open. What's Gucci? Oh yeah. Yo, so check this out right here. This right here is an off-white, uh... What, what would you call this? Let me see what the tag says. Uh, men's homie. It literally says men's homie. What's that, homie? Yo, this is actually pretty fire though, I'm not gonna lie. It is a size medium, so this... This one actually fits me. It's got 12 on the back. Yeah, I, I mess with this. It's like super lightweight too. Like I feel like, I feel like I can move in this. It's really, really nice. It feels like it would be see-through, but I don't see, can you see my nips through here? Nope. Next up, we got these boys right here. These right here are the Yeezy 350 Cinder. Super clean shoe. Absolutely love these things. I love that all black. You got the brown bottoms with the little accent of yellow down there. It's a pretty clean shoe. Black isn't very dark on these shoes. Like it's almost like a, Brown, black, cinder. Check this out. This right here is the cause share piece. This thing is stupid fire. Like, yo, look, look at how fire that is. He stands about seven feet tall. I don't really know the measurements, but he just looks so cool. You got cause standing proud with his hand on his stomach. Looks like he just ate some Taco Bell and might have some, uh, some die die. And then on the other side, we got my man just dangling down. We got cause holding him. It's, it's such a fire piece. Absolutely love it. Here, this is the Supreme Lamborghini skateboard. I'm going to try to zoom in for you guys so you can see like the sheen, like the sparkle on it. It looks so, so cool. Definitely a pretty unique collab, Supreme and Lamborghini, but it's such a sweet skate deck. I like it. First thing, we got this right here. Now, this is actually really cool. This right here is a bare brick. Now, from far away, it almost looks like a marble pattern or like, it looks like stone or just something cool like that. Well, if you look up close, it's actually this guy right here throwing a bunch of flowers. Now, this guy is the flower bomber. The artist who ended up making the flower bomber is an artist by the name of Banksy. He's a graffiti artist from London, and this is the first time that he's been on a bare brick, so this is a really cool piece. Next up, here we go with the cause. We got a lot of cause this video, okay? So if you guys like cause, you guys are gonna like this video. Whoa. Check this out. This right here is the cause what party figure. This is the yellow colorway. Now, I tried to go for the pink colorway at first, or no, the black colorway at first. And of course, your boy struck out, but I managed to cop a yellow. The yellow is so, like, yeah. I don't know if I'm gonna to resell this or end up keeping this one I might resell it because dad ended up copping the white one nice check it out this is such a cool cause figure this guy's going for around like 450 right now on the bottom you got cause what party and then Medicom toy it's a cool piece okay I like it but at the same time I kind of don't my man looks like he got Crazy back problems. I feel like he looks like Mr. Incredible when all those like sticky things went on him. Instead of having him stand up with like bad posture and everything, I think he's supposed to be displayed like this. Like right here, this is me on my third sit up, okay? I, I'm barely making it up there. We're coming close, but no. no. Next up, I'm gonna go through the skateboards that we got. The Prime skate deck, the snow camo. This right here is a DGK. Virgil Abloh collab. Absolutely insane. Last but not least with the skate decks, we have a Kith Looney Tunes board. Come on, look at the graphic on that. We got Bugs Bunny, the Tasmanian Devil. Oh my, we got everybody. We got Roadrunner. Oh, we got Roadrunner too. He's running off the skateboard. We got some more cause. This right here is the cause take figure. You ready? Wait. Happy Christmas. Oh wait. 
wait, wait. Check this figure out. This thing is so cool. Now this one right here is my dad's. He ended up copping this boy. Now in most situations, when it comes to these like cause figures and my dad gets one, I'd be jealous, right? I'd be like, yo, like, mm, I want that so bad. Well, I don't want it, okay? I don't want his cause figure, you know why? Eat my butt, dad! Actually, that just, just don't. Boom, I got one too, double trouble. What's going on? What was that, what? Uh, that was weird. It just don't. Just, that, that was weird. Just, this is just such a dope figure. You got my man holding his little, his little child. Okay, he's taking somebody's child away. Why is he doing that? I don't know. This cause figure is going for around like six fifty. Such a cool figure. I don't know if I'm gonna undes mine. Like I don't know if I want to take him out of the box. Like we are, we got one on display already. Do I need to take him out? What would you do? Oh, you thought we were done with the cars? Uh-uh. Boom. Check it out. Right here, we have the cause space figure. Not just is the box extremely dope, but let's crack it open. This figure is actually pretty heavy. Oh, look at that. Look at, look at the packaging. Well, Would you look at that? Yeah, this thing is deluxe. Ba boom look at this thing. Would you look at that? Right here we have the Cause Astronaut. This is so, so cool. This thing just reminds me of the Cause MTV Award. The detail on this thing is absolutely insane. And it is heavy. Like, it is very, very heavy. They also ended up making a black and a gold colorway. I think the silver goes hard. Like, you can't go wrong with that. This thing's going for around $1,200. It's a dope piece. Feeling by, like, the weight of this, it just feels like that much. And next up right here, we got a pair of some Yeezys. These right here are my dad's. We got size 11 on deck. Now, I'm pretty sure. Yep. These right here are the Yeezy Zions. This is such a clean shoe. Next up, this is very cool. Right here, this box says Mr. Flower Fantastic. Right here, you can see we have a size on this box. You're thinking I'm about to pull out the craziest pair of shoes in your life. Well, I'm not about to pull out the craziest shoes you've ever seen, but the craziest shoe you've ever seen. Would you look at that? Right here, we have an Air Jordan 1 flower pot. Or if you really just want to be that guy, you could have an Air Jordan 1 coffee mug. If you want to drink from it, go right ahead, bud. There is a little hole on the bottom right here. This thing filled up with flowers just looks so, so cool. I mean, it's just a piece of art. Like, it's literally, look at how cool it is. 10 out of 10. Absolutely love this thing. Next up, we got a big boy. Okay, look at this. This is let me, let me bring my table back. This right here is the actual flower bomber. Now this is my dad's, so like, oh no, God! It's not actually in there. If he saw me do it with it in there, I'd probably be sleeping out in the garage. <laughs> Check it out, this is such a dope art piece. I mean, just look at the detail on this thing. It's so, so nice. This is a Metacom toy. It symbolizes a really good meaning to like make you know, art, not war. But Joe, next item we ended up picking up was this guy right here. Talk about some fire. So the artist Joshua Vides, the guy who does all of the cartooning stuff, he ended up doing a collab with Rolex and he ended up making this hat with them. And this hat is just so dope. Rolex hat. I think it's just such a cool hat. I don't know what kind of style this is. I forget. It's like... It's not a five panel, but there's only five panels. So like, next up, guys, I'm telling you, I'm showing you guys the heat today. So right here, story on this, we got a cause figure. Now this figure is like no figure that we had ever seen before. Check it out. My man is literally laying down. Let me pull him out for you guys. This cause companion figure is so cool. He's literally laying down, like he's laying down on his face. It's how I feel half the time. Cause is my mood. I swear, I'm like so obsessed with cause figures. At this point, I should just get like tattoos of X's on my eyelids. <laughs> Super dope figure. I did get it for retail. And that exact day, that exact order, we were straight Gordon Ramsay cooking. We got two of these boys. This one's a little hard to see through the plastic. Unfortunately, I can't take this guy out. But Cause did like a surprise drop where they ended up releasing old BFFs on the site. Sure enough, your boy 
I got a black BFF. So now we got a black one and a pink one. It's kind of sad that I'm an adult and I still love collecting toys. It's not a phase, mom! I'm just gonna pull the other shoe out too because this all came in the set. Now one thing about the, woo, what the f Oh my gosh. Guys, I opened up the box and that was, that was in there. I thought he was gonna fight me. How you doing? But yo, last but not least inside this haul right here, we got some Kobe's. Now, I didn't end up copping these. My dad ended up copping these. And oh my God, am I jealous. Check it out. We got the Kobe Grinches. Guys, these things are fire. Sure enough, he ended up copping these on Sneakers app. Like, how, bruh? How do you cop so many fire sneakers? I don't really have any Kobe's that I rock, but the colorway on these, I just... I think they're dope. It looks like a snake. Just look at that. Look into my eyes, Jungle Book. Woo! You made it through all that stuff. Congratulations. I shall now give you a love. I give you my love. I love you. But guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to smash that subscribe button. But guys, as always, I love you so much, and I'll see you in the next video. Deuces.